and welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another Dollar Tree haul. Some of these things I've had for quite a while, um, probably since just a few days after my last Dollar Tree haul. So you've probably seen a lot of these, but I wanted to go ahead and do this anyway. So I'll go ahead and start with the food first as usual. I got some of the French fry seasoning, the Supreme Tradition 5 ounce. And this smells really good. It smells kind of like a seasoning salt, but with like a little bit extra to it. I don't know what it is, but it smells really good. I think it'd be really good on some fries. I don't know if y'all have a Zaxby's around where you're at, but um, it's like a chicken, uh, fast food chicken place. Not like a KFC, but they have more like a chicken strips and boneless wings and wings and stuff like that. But um, they have seasoned fries and their seasoning kind of tastes similar to this. So I thought that would be good to try out to kind of make my own fries because I really like theirs. I found some of the hot sauce. This is the Lingnum's hot sauce. I got the extra hot, which my husband loves extra hot things. And this one is just, it just says hot sauce, sweet and spicy. So I thought that would be good. Um, and this one does says, say hot and spicy on it. So these are a 12.6 ounce jar or bottle. <laughs> um, if you've tried these, let me know if they're any good because my husband loves hot sauce on everything. So I think that he will like those. Um, I got some candy as usual. I got the Mike and Ike Patriotic Mix. And this has cherry pie, cherry pie flavored, vanilla ice cream, and blueberry cobbler flavored. I thought these would be really good. So, got those. I got two packages of the Smarties Gumballs. They are, they're 15 in a pack. We love Smarties and we love gum, so I thought those would be good. I got some of the Shrek, the DreamWorks Shrek oatmeal in the Ogre Apple Cinnamon. There are eight pouches in here. We like oatmeal here, so that would be good. I got some of the McCormick Grill Mates seasoning. Um, this is the Montreal Steak Marinade. And I think these are about a dollar anywhere else, so it's not really a good deal. I thought these would be good to try. I also got the Brown Sugar Bourbon Marinade and the Mesquite marinade so I thought those would be good. I found these Waffle Works waffle cookies uh, vanilla flavored and blueberry flavored. I've not seen these before. I think the Waffle Works is the ones that did like the um, the waffle thing that had like chocolate in the middle of them like a waffle cookie but it was like a chocolate cookie. I don't know if that makes any sense but I wanted to try these. I'm gonna go ahead and try the blueberry one right now. Okay this is what they look like just like a little little wafer little tiny waffle I guess. These are really good. It tastes like a blueberry waffle or a, a frozen blueberry waffle. <laughs> There's a little bit of a difference but yeah it tastes really good. I got the toothbrushes that everybody's been hauling. This is the Oral-B Pro Health Stages Power Toothbrush and it has the Monsters Ink on there. I got two of those. I picked up some of the Dial Soap, the Spring Water Scent, uh, the two bar pack. Um, I use this to clean my makeup sponges with so and it works great. Love it. Picked up some more flossers. These are the AIM 60 count precision and I probably haul these in just about every Dollar Tree haul but I love these. I got some eye drops. I got the Mirin Plus for dry eyes. I got the Redness, the Redness Relief and the original. I really do like these. I picked up some garbage bags. These are the small garbage bags, the vanilla scented. There are 50 bags in here and these are perfect for my little trash can down here under my makeup desk. So I had the rose scented before which they're not strongly scented or anything. Um, but they're just like the perfect size. The, the vanilla actually smells really good. I found some of the Mucinex Fast Max Severe Cold and there are four packets in here. I got two of these. I thought that was a good deal for Mucinex. They're pretty expensive I think. I got some of the Elmer's School Glue, washable school glue and this is just like a little three pack of the pins. We're always using glue for school projects and whatnot so there we go. Um, I picked up one of these, the Bolero Body Scrub in the Argonish Shea Butter, which I wanted to get the scrub before, but I accidentally picked up the lotion, I think. So I got this. Um, I did use one of the other scents, and the scrub was um, not very exfoliating. It was very gritty, if that makes any sense, but I don't know if this really actually does any good as far as exfoliating or not, but I do like the smell of this one. So I got the Bolero Bath Fizzers. I got the lavender and chamomile, the lemon verbena and mint, coconut milk and mango, and argan and shea butter. I don't really need any more nails, but I thought these were just adorable. These are the Sassy and Chic brand, and they have the cutest little butterflies on them. I thought those were so pretty. I found this cute little nail file. It's a two pack, and it is a 3D nail file. It has hearts on one and little lipsticks on the other. So cute. 
like that. I picked up some of the Wet n Wild brushes. I got the small eyeshadow brush and the large concealer brush and the contour brush. And these I think are normally 99 cents anyway at like Walgreens, but I went ahead and got some more anyway. You can never have too many brushes. And I found another toothbrush in the bag, so I got three of them. <laughs> and I picked up some of these Polaroid decorative labels, and I got this shape. And I, what I probably, I may not print on these. I may just, just take the label off and write on them. I haven't decided yet, but got that. There are 240 in here, and I got that shape. And I got the cute little stars. Let me open a pack so you can kind of see what size. I'm not sure if they are all the same size or not. It kind of says overall size of label so I'm not sure if they are that means that they're all the same size or not so they probably are let's see so this is the size of this shape <laughs> um yeah they'd be good just to take a sharpie and write on there instead of having to print on them but I thought they were nice they'd be good for organizing I found some of the iHome brand um, iPad covers and I found this one it's, it's really cute. It says I home down here, kind of embroidered on there, and this is like a canvas, like an off-white canvas. But that was really nice. And I think, I know that these definitely retail for more than a dollar, possibly around 10 give or take. I'm not really sure. And I also found this one. This one says it's the retro style, and it is just like a dark blue with a dark purple and light purple polka dots. That was cute. This one, I thought it was so adorable. It's just the composition book looking one. It's the red composition. And this is just what the inside looks like of it. Um, it just kind of clips in here. It has the little strap. I thought that was really cute. And the last thing I found was this iHome protective sleeve for all iPad models. It's really cute. Um, it's, let me take it out of this plastic here. And it's cute. It says iHome right there. And it's like a perforated material. I don't know if you can see it. but It's really cute. And then... Let me just slide this off. Oh, it's really cute. It's blue on the inside. And it's like a little soft, kind of furry, almost. And, yeah. and it's like, it's cushiony too, so kind of be protective for your iPad. I was really happy to find those. I was looking for the iPad covers for a really long time, so I'm happy I found some. So that's it for my Dollar Tree haul. Just want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram and Snapchat, both down below. And I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.